Today we're going to show you the three of the five side control techniques. One, when we control the triceps, we can attack the arm, attack the left arm, attack the neck. Two, when the bad guy's got the elbow in and now I need to fix myself, go to side mount two. And three, he puts the underhook in and how I stop him from using the under underhook from escaping. His arm too much, I'm doing something wrong, I gotta grab the floor. I always need four base. I can sacrifice one, I still have my elbow, but I, I control the tricep here. He brings that arm in, I go to two. Bang, look, my elbow's out wide. My knee stays tight in his butt. I saw a couple people, your knees are away. I'm away from my principal. I need my knee in his butt. Whichever way he goes, I follow. If he starts bringing his butt this way, I start saying, yeah, I just follow him. No problem. If his arm comes underneath and he gets an underhook, I can't stay here. He's going to use his underhook. He's going to go low. He's, go ahead, show me how I go. Yeah, I have nothing, I have nothing there. So now... I need to fix myself and go to side mount three. So once this underhook goes in, I need to hand come aside. By the way, if I have a little bit of a bigger opponent and my elbow doesn't touch, I can go here. Same with side mount one. I can go here. I don't have to be on my elbows. So if I have a thin opponent, I'm here. If he's a little bigger, I can go here. No problem. Anyway, but I'm here. My hand goes over. Other side, now I go a little bit north-south, my knee comes in his head, and this hand comes over and I block this hip. Now I try to use that underhook, go. It doesn't work no more. It doesn't work. It works a little bit, but now I stopped his underhook. Now I still have his arm and his neck. So I can either be here, I like to be here a lot. And I can see everything. So side mount two, he has his elbow in. Brings his arm underneath. I gotta fix myself, side mount one, or side mount three, sorry. However I like to be. Now I stopped his underhook. Side mount four is when he lifts his knee up. We always see guys do this. Why are they lifting their knee up? Because they don't want me to go mount. They're trying to block the mount. Bad idea. Anytime you do this, I'm thinking, kill you. You're giving me your leg and we'll get, we'll get real deep into why never, ever do this. But I'm gonna go into side mount four once I see this. I loop underneath, grab the floor, grab the floor, my knees are tight, and I sit back. Go ahead, move. He can move. Oh, now I start attacking his arm, his neck here. So, he's a strong guy, yeah, he can get his leg out. But this stops him pretty good. My knees are tight, grab the floor, my butt's down. So he gets that underhook. Boom. Going north-south a little bit. Blocking his head. Blocking his head. Block his head. He brings his leg up. Thank you. Boom. You guys got the idea? Yes. Let's do it. One, two. 